Do you play Katana in Mortal Kombat 1? Well, here are the best cameos that you need to be using. Take it one step at a time. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and let's get into these cameos. In no particular order, my first recommendations to use with Katana are the freezing cameos such as Frost and Sub-Zero. And the main reason why is Katana's awesome set plays with her traps are huge for her gameplay. A great pop-up and of course the potential for combos is insane. Being able to use Frost in a combo like that, go for the low freeze and then set up your traps is just a huge play, big brain play, or just allows you for combo setups with her fans, like so. Or what's really cool, there's two set plays you can do with Frost's orb, her back cameo here. You can put your opponent in the air, then set up the orb while they're getting knocked down and have that pressure while they do so. Or you can do two traps at once. You can do Frost's back cameo, the orb there, set your trap, now your opponent has two things to worry about, the floor trap and of course Frost Sword. There's just a lot of plays you can do with Frost as a cameo. And of course the same thing applies as Sub-Zero as a cameo, the ability to freeze your opponent mid combo, get the air set up for your fans, is just 500 IQ play. Or the same thing applies, you can freeze your opponent mid combo and then set up your trap. That way when they're unfrozen, you're ready to rock. There are just so many things you can do to set your opponent up. And of course Sub-Zero as a cameo gives you projectile invulnerability, allowing you to set your traps up without the worry of being zoned out. Again, big brain plays. Because you can put your opponent in the air quite easily using Katana and her fans and her trap setups, using Jax is another great option because a lot of his cameo moves require your opponent to be in the air, like so. Another set play that I love doing with Jax and Katana is throwing out Katana's traps on the ground. And if they decide to block that, throw out Jax's standard cameo move for the unblockable. So now they're almost forced to jump if they try to block your trap, allowing you to rush in in the air for air combos or throw your fan out there to catch them if they jump. Just a lot of mind games you can play with Jax Katana. That's just so much fun to do. You would think that her four to one, two combo is overhead, but it's not. In fact, Katana really lacks in the overhead department and honestly just the mix up department in general and using Striker as a cameo really fills that void for Katana, giving her an overhead option giving her a great low option as well. The grenades offer awesome combo continuation in the air. And the best part about Striker as a cameo is his down cameo move, the re-stance with his cuff. And that's really good for Katana, allowing her to continue the pressure with her traps, her fans, making your opponent want to jump. And if they do, you catch them off guard and then re-stand them with Striker's down cameo, the cuffs. So here's how that might look with Striker re-standing your opponent mid combo basically negating their option to do a wake up attack on you, giving you the option, do you want to set your trap? What do you want to do with your opponent once they're cuffed? Another great option that I love to run is Scorpion as a cameo for Katana because again, Scorpion as a cameo offers awesome air combo continuation. And one of the best tools that Scorpion offers is his back cameo, the full screen reset with armor, giving that space in the Katana wants to again, set her traps, making your opponent hesitate to approach you and giving you control of the field. Because again, if they try jumping in, they're throwing the fan out and just catching them off guard. Plus again, lacking in the mix-up department, Scorpion offers a great overhead for just mix-ups, but also combo continuation. Katana really benefits from Cameo Scorpion's entire moveset and you love to see it. These are just my Cameo recommendations for Katana, guys. Let me know down below who do you pair Katana up with and why. Subscribe here for more fighting game content and take it one step at a time.